crazy. Okay. Doing my thing. It's number four today, Young Jeezy and Hope go crazy. Puffy has walked into the building. It's with I, Sire. Puffy is, Puffy is here today. Yes, New York, New York, New York, please turn your radios on. There are two sides to every story. We get the other side today. Yeah, there's only one fact. Okay. There's only one truth. We're going to give you a chance, and we're going to give you a chance to state that. Oh, yeah, no doubt. I know that you have a bunch of paperwork with you, so I'm curious. Yeah, because he said the paperwork that. game was tight, so I heard. I'm, I'm just, I really want to pull quotes because I'm a good listener, so. All right, the paperwork so, game is tight, and sometimes the paperwork, you know, um, the paperwork are just the facts. Before we, I have to hand this to something, so I know you just walked in. I'm going to let you take a minute, get some yeah, water or something. Yeah, and some water, let me wet my palate. And then we're gonna uh, we're gonna handle this, and we're gonna come back, and we're gonna talk to Puff, and we're gonna um, yeah, we, get we, to the phones. No, you know, we, we we it's gonna be clear, and and it's also um, we we we're gonna give a a um, a tutorial, you know, we're gonna give a a ah. a, 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 a consultation, you to know, to the city. A, no, no, to the locks. Mm. We're gonna give a consultation to the warlocks. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I named them the locks. So now, since it's all that, they got to go back to the wall locks. All right, we're going to... Wow. All right. I don't know where this is going to go today. <laughs> no, it ain't, it's going to go. It's going to go very, very peaceful. Yeah, you no. Know, it's gonna go I would very, hope so. You know, you know what it I is? would it's, hope it's, so. It's going to be... They, they should listen so they, should, they, they can learn because... You know, it's, it's very clear that they don't understand the business that they're in for 10 years. But we're we going to make it simple and plain, you know, so why don't we pay some bills so we ain't got to stop talking. All right, good, so that we could just go. Let me just handle this right quick, and we'll be right back with Call Puff. stand up. On Hot 97. You, you want to you wanna talk about what the number is? Let, let, let's talk about the number. Since the locks was out here, they was here yesterday, and they said they didn't get no money. They didn't say they didn't get no money. The locks... They okay. said they felt that at this point in their okay. career that it's, yeah. th it doesn't make sense. They feel like you get okay. more money. So, so I'm gonna ask you. I'm gonna tell you what I got. Work. I'm gonna tell you what I got. Mm -hmm. Let's ask. Let's ask you. Let's remove me in the locks. Me and you in the business deal. I meet you when you coming up. You want me to invest in you. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You a new company. Mm -hmm. I invested in D Block. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I'm investing in you. Mm -hmm. You a new company. Mm -hmm. At the end of the day. Here come the splits. Out of the money, you get over one point five million dollars, mm -hmm. and I get four hundred or under four hundred thousand dollars. That's it, New mm -hmm. York. They got over one point five million dollars, and I got this was back then. No, this is everything. That, everything to date, they got one point five. Their whole career. Albums. They got for for the albums they put out. These, these remember they the streets. They not making no number one top ten pop records. Mm -hmm. They the streets. So they sitting here crying like I got more money. That's the money that I got. I'm devoted. Really? I don't even speak my information on the street. I will never, they ever, ever honestly, do this again. Honestly, just because I'm, 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 I let you get some of that um, specifics in. We didn't really get into too much of the specifics yesterday. I, I guess just the point that they came up here was... You know, they might be misinformed. I don't know. Yeah. Yes or no about how much exactly it is. But either way, they they have been, they, they say, trying to get off of, out of this publishing deal for yeah. 10 years. Check this. Okay, okay. If, if, if you, check this out. If, if you, you yourself, you invest in AT&T. Right. Okay. No, I get it. No, I no, get no, it. No, no, no. You invest in AT&T. Mm -hmm. AT&T, they didn't even start making phones. Then AT&T, whatever years later, say that they want your shares back. But there's no reason. They just say that they just want their shares back. Or even better, you buy a house. You go and you buy a house on set in Harlem. You go buy the house and... I mean, I get it. No, You're no, investing, so, yeah, you no, want no, no, to... Yeah, yeah, but I'm saying it, it doesn't... So they've been calling, knock on the door saying they want their house back. They had sold their house. They didn't even sell a house. To be honest, they came up here and they're portraying in New York that they sold a house. I don't own their house. Puff does not own 50%. Puff owns 20%. I don't never divulge my information on my business, but it's just the fact that this is just so crazy. And I'm just, at, it's not even worth it's, it. These, the, the, this, this is not even worth it to me. Right. So out of the house that I bought, I don't even own the house. I just invested in the ground floor. So now you say, just give me the ground floor back just because. I could see if, I could see if it was what they were saying. They came up here and cried to New York. They cried broke. They used the word slavery. 
over one point five million dollars in slavery, and I get four hundred. That's slavery. There's people that are really feeling like they working in the streets. Streets keep it real. There's people that are struggling, and you they, they up here crying. Stop whining, man. I mean. Let me just ask you this, and I, ha I have to play a song, and I'm going to give you a chance with the, with the paperwork and all that. We'll get into all of that. Just my, uh, one question I have is that um, w one of the issues yesterday was that they felt like, Jadica said this specifically, that they got into the game, they was young, now they blame their lawyers, they blame themselves, but it's been 10 years, and they just feel like they were taken advantage of when they, and when nah, they were nah, younger. Nah. And, 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 and I'm going to go back Taken advantage of by okay. you. So I took advantage of them by me so while they had... 300 members of the Rough Riders. They had, they went through seven lawyers. Mm -hmm. They all had two parents, and I took advantage of them. Come mm -hmm. on, man. They can say that all they want. It's just not the truth, and it's here in black and white. So I took advantage of you. How did I take advantage of them if they got over 1.5 mm -hmm. and I got four? Is that taking advantage of me and you in a business deal? Right. And, and I invest in you, and you make 1.5 and I make four. Am I taking advantage of you? Am no. I? Am I? No. Okay. That's the facts. Let's talk about the facts, ladies and gentlemen. That's the facts. That's what it is. Black and white. Here to cancel checks. I sent it to their accountant because they're not on top of their business. I, I wanna, they're speaking emotionally and they're not on top. You ever know somebody and they just speak off the cuff and they haven't really gotten into the details or do their homework? Why can't you guys sit all... Why can't you sit down and work this out? Angie. Angie. Can't? Angie. Angie, you must. Angie, you you or whoever else is not listening to me. I invited, I am I invited to you. them to the office. You got to ask them. I invite them, even still, even still, because I know they ain't not busting a grape. They can still come to my office. I will, I will, I will, I will act like this didn't even happen. I'll erase yesterday. I'll, I'll, cause I, my mind is strong like that. So you're willing to sit down at this point? And Angie, I told I told you the story that I saw the man. I told him to sit down. I see him at the concert. They ain't say nothing to me. How you gonna be on stage with somebody rocking the Benjamins in front of all of New York? You didn't say none of that. You got him right there. What, then what, what did I do? I disappeared like Abracadabra? Now I've been here. I'm gonna be at the office every day. So I'm gonna tell you. So you clear? You bring him to the office then? Me? Anybody can. If somebody see him, him in, if somebody see him, see him in the streets, bring, bring him to the him. office. I'll bring him. We set they, up they, the they meeting. They called out to New York to help him. Help them to give them a ride to the office. <laughs> Can we play? Let me just play one song <laughs> so we can regroup and get. Can we play a Biggie song? You wanna? Yeah, 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 yeah. Which Biggie song? You ain't giving a new joint? <laughs> yeah, yeah, play the single. Play the nasty we will, joint. We will too have to talk about the C's call and all yeah, of that you stuff. Can get, you, too, can get in, you can get into all it, but it's very okay. important that all up, I'm, all up and coming artists read and understand. Your contracts and your paperwork. Give the locks, some, the locks. The system. Come on, man, just give me. The locks ain't getting jerked. They got their money. There it is. And it ain't fifty fifty. It's eighty twenty. And I'm glad that I'm glad I was able to inform y'all of that. Y'all need to scream on your accounts and lawyers and yourselves for not reading because it's right here. I'm gonna highlight and show Angie your contract. If you read your contract, it says eighty percent. Is it there? All right, we're gonna, look, we're gonna look at the contracts. We're gonna play a couple biggie joints while we do that. New hip hop, new R&B, hot 97. Run a new joint now. Keep it hot. Run, run. When you hear new music, you know it's hot 97, baby. I'm sticking ice chicks on the tip of you. Did you f*** a quick kick? Ain't that some... Either way, we can go. Yeah, one, one thing you You'll send paperwork. They'll send paperwork. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can you it's, sit it's, down and it's, can it's, you? It's king. It's, it's, it's What would it take for them? Eighty twenty. What, what would right them? Here. What would it take for them to get a hundred percent of their publishing if back? It, if it hold on, if it wasn't true, their lawyer could go and they could play this in a court of law. Why would I set myself up for that? That's number one. Okay. Number two is I definitely need to apologize to New York for feeling a little emotional, but you got to understand, being working as hard as I've worked to get to this point, and somebody saying. That you stole from them, you know what I'm saying? And you, and and you, I'm my my, my thing is to always to inspire, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. and, and to and to motivate and to provide opportunities, and 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 to be. And so when I when I felt when I came up here being emotional, it was just it was just me expressing to y'all the, the true feelings. I got to give it to you true because I've never been at this point where somebody where it's such a blatant misrepresent since the last time I was on trial for the gun a blatant misrepresentation of the truth you know what I'm saying and it was just it was so upsetting because it was like I own 50% of somebody's stuff and it's a lifetime deal that's not true they have five they have, we, we have them for five more options so 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 you gotta look they at said like that this. yesterday but we they have, said that a, they have to be on let me just say what it is so you okay. can defend it you can instead of just putting it out there they said they have 
the, the deal is that they, the albums that they have left that they owe you for publishing is on Bad Boy. So since they're on not on Bad mm. Boy, that they can't. They, and that, that, it's that, not true. This is what really, you're saying. This is really in New York. We shouldn't. To be honest, this is so embarrassing for them and for me to be saying it like this mm. because they just don't know the business. That's not the truth. That's not the truth. You know. You know. You know how we can stop it though. As okay. grown people, let's talk about the facts. This is this facts. I'm a state. You got the checks in front of you. You reading it. The, the, we, we, I also got, have a contract okay. that they just sent yeah, yeah, me yeah, that but, says fifty fifty. Yeah, but I, I'm, I'll show you this contract. But you know we do. Okay. We're going back and forth. I know. At the, at the end of the day, this business is between me and the locks. Great. I'm only stating the facts. I would not come up here and misrepresent myself. That's number one. Okay. You let me ask. But anybody that knows how me, publishing works knows that I can't own fifty percent of their publishing because fifty percent goes. So the, the publishing that you do have, it obviously means a lot to them. Would you be willing to sell them back or give them back their publishing? How? Is there any way that could happen? I'm going to say, number one, they never had a discussion and never gave me an offer to buy it back. That's number one. Number two is they say that they're the streets. If you you go and you get some consignment for five of them things from Poppy, and then you go to Poppy and say, nah, I, ju I just don't want to give it back. You know what I'm saying? That don't make sense. If he invested in you and get invested in your dream to come up, and he gave you five of them things, and you owe him five, that's what you're supposed to give him. But even more important, you never even had a conversation with me. They never had a conversation. They never. It's so they, hard to if, do this interview yeah, because it's so. If, 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 the if, stories if, are yeah, so yeah. conflicting. If, if they get, but, but there's one story. If I'm bringing canceled checks, I can't do no more than that. They came up here and they made y'all believe that they don't want to rap no more because. But this is a fake. You you you're not even acknowledging this is what they do. Free the locks one. Free the locks part two with Interscope. Hey, that worked. Jimmy got on the phone. Let's go after Puff. Let's see if this worked. It definitely worked because they hit a nerve. And it's not really, really like me, but it's just like this station right here is a very strong station. Mm -hmm. And that's a very strong accusation of stealing from somebody. You know what I'm saying? And I don't have no, I got mine off of hard work. I don't have to steal from nobody. You said you're going to let me do some questions. Yes. Let me do some questions. <laughs> let me yeah. do some questions. Are you willing to give them back or sell them back their publishing? If the right situation is presented, What would it take? Yes. I mean, we've taken it this far. There's, there's checks laying out here. We've taken it this far. What would it take Angie, for you, them to have their publishing Angie, back? you got to understand in the record business, it's not that simple. you got to sit down with the accountants and with the lawyers and deal with the facts. But you're it's, willing it's, to... It's not that... I've said for 20 times I'm at the office. So we keep asking the same question. I'm going to be at the office so you bring them up so you can see... Me. Whoever. I'm gonna bring them. Can we set up a business meeting? Bring them. Bring them. For real. Lawyers. For real. Can we set up a business you meeting? Could, they could have been had a business meeting. Angie, it didn't take all of this. For whatever reason, they feel like they can't. They couldn't have. <sighs> okay. So okay. So Tell me about we, this quote. We, we, I'm giving you talking. a chance to respond to the accusations yesterday, okay. but you're not letting me put them out there for you to respond to. Let me please. Let me just put them out there. And you respond. Okay. Did we get the last one clear? That they can have a meeting. New York. We can have a meeting. See? see lives, Check. That's done. Meeting. Check. One thing done. Bring their lawyers too. Check. Accomplished. Okay. Second thing. Um. <laughs> they they did say that they have tried to reach out to you. They actually even quoted you as saying, Paul McCartney, I mean, the Beatles can't talk to Michael Jackson about they publish him. Angie, as I told you before, I brought it up to them. This whole thing stemmed from the beef that they have now that they're not dealing with their own beef. And at the end okay. of one of the mixtape records, they got a, a, a bomb thrown at them. And so I brought it up to Jada. Like, yo, I know that must be on your mind. If you ever want to talk to me, he never brought it up to me. That's like your man sitting next to you. He don't talk about something. They need to have the heart to talk about it. Don't nobody help them. Drop them off at the office. Let them come talk to me themselves. They never did that. We're going to set up a business meeting. We're going <laughs> to set up a business meeting and start with that. Time. Okay, so then C's calls up yesterday. I guess the publishing discussion sparked the nerve in little C's who called up and said that you own some of you own some of Biggie's publishing still. Mm -hmm. And he obviously felt a way about that. Felt you should give come up off of it, is what he said, mm -hmm. and give it to... You know what I'm going to do for that? I'm, I'm going to let Miss Wallace, she, she she's calling in. I'm going to let her handle that. I'm going to let her... Okay. She, she, she called and asked to answer that. She said that's her son's business. She wants to answer that. The locks may want to put their business out in the street. She said if her son's business is going to be put out in the street, she wants to answer that. So she, she, she wants to speak on it. Yeah, she wants to speak on so it. So we so calling her? Yeah, You're you going to get her on the phone? Yeah. Okay, we're going to get Miss Wallace on the telephone. Who's gonna somebody do it from out there? All right, let's play. Want to play a Biggie joint and then give get a second to get Miss Wiles on the phone and. Yeah, definitely. We need to play the Biggie new single off the Duets album, featuring Nelly, Jagged Edge, myself, Notorious B.I.G. The new single, Jazzy Fizzle. Out, Jazzy Fizzle, 
album in stores December 20th. Really, come because on, y'all. Everybody in the music industry knows that they are not going to run up or be on no off. Universal ain't even going to take the call. They're going to be okay. Y'all want to get off? You got a contract. Okay, but as like it stands, as it stands, I'm just trying to... 80%. I'm sorry. I'm just trying to just clarify because I just got another <laughs> yeah. fact. 80%, 80% goes to them. Is that right? 80% goes to them. Okay. All right. So as it stands, there's going to be a business meeting with some lawyers involved. It could have been one yesterday. Ain't nobody showed up. I got a video. All right, well, but got, now, I'm going to be clear because I, I make sure my stuff is quoted right. Have them send you their number. Mm -hmm. Let's keep it gangster. Have them send you their number. I'm gonna call him. I'm gonna call him myself. When you let, leave here, let, let, let's get. You'll call them tonight. Let, let, let's get. I'm gonna call him right over there by the coke machine because you know grown men handle business. This is not gangster. This is just so not. This is not. This is not even manly. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. This is a borderline. You know, funny style. You know what I'm saying? When you got a situation, you handle it man to man. Angie can't help the situation. New York can't help it. You gotta help yourself. You come and see me, and so I can teach you. And then you're going to dance. You, I mean, you, you, I think you're really going to thank me. You know what I'm saying? I think you're going to thank me because I invested in and I believed in y'all. We shouldn't have no beef. Y'all believed in me. I believed in y'all. I never said nothing derogatory about them or nobody else. You wanted to leave. I let you go. Any other record label would have left you there. But let's handle it like men. Don't call the radio station up when you could call me. All right? All That's right. it. Call me. Don't make a mixtape. You can call me. I don't play those games. So you're gonna call, call them after this? I'll there will call be a them. I want them to call me. But they. I they want did them to say they me. were coming back next week. It's to up to them. They're not <laughs> under contractually <laughs> hey, yo, obligated. Hey, yo, if they come back next week, New York, I'm just letting it. Know. And once they get finished, drive them to the office. I'll be there so we can stop. Good. Being that would be great. That would be great if you guys could have a meeting before next week. Um, all right, Puffy, thank you. I know you got any going yeah. on. The, I know you yeah. had, you know. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm going to end it on a positive note, just to, ju ju just the way things should be ended. Because everybody's listening, looking at hip-hop and looking at us and, and looking at what we do and how we handle ourselves. Mm -hmm. I have no problem with the locks. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I'm definitely grateful for the time I had with them, the experience, the association, the times we had on stage, the time we even had last week at the Meadowlands in Philly. I thank them for the Benjamins, you know what I'm saying? Being a part of that, writing mm -hmm. it for me. I'm a fan of theirs. I, I, I can only get worked up off of real beef. This ain't beef, y'all. You know what I'm saying? I ain't got no problem with them. I wish that they would just handle their business and handle it like mature men and not put their business out in the street and come deal with me directly. So it's out in the street. I'm going to pull back. They can say whatever they want. But I'm saying positively, I'm going to act like yesterday ain't happened. Y'all can come see me anytime. Y'all come to the video tonight. I mean, I can't keep it no realer than that. All that right? And there it is. You ready, E? God One bless time. New York. Thank y'all for listening. Bad for coming for life. Today. It's the yeah. Rush yeah. Hour. Yeah. DJ yeah. Enough. Yeah. Call me up, man. 1 800 223 ready for that new big year in the final chapter. Sign 97. Hey, MJG in the house. And shout to Los. Official number one. Let's go.